forecast. All right, after a beautiful day, we will be bringing in the chance of some showers and thunderstorms tomorrow night. But I think the bigger story for tomorrow will be the increasing humidity. Right now, dew points in the 50s. That means it's very comfortable. You know that if you had a chance to enjoy the outdoors today. Tomorrow, that changes up to 67 for a dew point. We stay muggy on Tuesday with dew points in the upper 60s. So enjoy the next few hours while the low humidity lasts. Live pinpoint Doppler 12, not picking up on any precipitation. Tomorrow, we may get a a little bit of light drizzle at the coast before about nine in the morning. After that, we clear out to partly sunny skies. This is around noon time, and then the daylight hours of tomorrow should remain rain free. If you're hanging out in places like Pasco, Northwest Rhode Island, you may start to see the skies get a little bit dark. But I really think the precipitation holds off until past midnight. You can see these showers and thunderstorms sweep through. This is around two o'clock in the morning. That would be Tuesday morning. So we'll have to keep an eye on the Tuesday morning commute. Actually, both the morning and the evening commute on Tuesday for the chance of a few strong thunderstorms. Michelle will have an update on that tomorrow morning. I'll be looking at more data later on tonight on Eyewitness News. This is uh, 5 o'clock Tuesday morning with some showers in the vicinity. So that's why we put you in the medium category on the threat tracker for late tomorrow night into Tuesday. But keep in mind, tomorrow should be mostly rain free. How about this? packed at Narragansett Beach. People really enjoying themselves today. Beautiful blue sky right now over the capital city. We saw a lot of that this afternoon. Temperatures right now pleasant. 79 in Smithfield, 83 Providence, 77 in Newport, and 79 in Westerly. So our next weather maker off to our north and west again. This will not bring most of those showers until tomorrow night, so it takes a while to get here. And as we go to tomorrow morning, because of the increase in humidity, we already start in the 70s for the morning commute. By noontime into the afternoon, mid to upper 80s inland, very humid and upper 70s to around 80 and breezy at the coast. So going to the beach, not a perfect day. You may fight through a little bit of fog and drizzle in the morning, but then partly sunny by the afternoon. And then once we get through Tuesday, Wednesday is cooler and much less humid, cooler to end mm. the week as well with highs only in the upper 70s. Less humidity is always good. Yes, it is. Right, Pete, thank you very much. Coming up on Eyewitness News.